Hello everyone! Welcome to my channel! This is Mom Saibel Explains. This video is all about order of operations. We call it PEMDAS or JAMDAS. PEMDAS is an acronym used to remind people of the order of operations. This means that you don't have to solve math problems from left to right. Rather, you solve them in a predetermined order that is given to you via acronym PEMDAS or JEMDAS. First, we have the groupings, which includes parentheses, brackets, and braces. Second, we have the exponent. And third, we have the multiplication and division. And remember, it's whichever comes first. And the fourth is addition and subtraction, whichever comes first. Okay. Let us have some examples here. Question number one, that's 27 minus 9 divided by 3 times the quantity of 4 times 1. Okay, we have choices here. That's A, 15, B, 18, C, 24, D, 25. Which do you think is our answer? We cannot answer this when we don't know what is PEMDAS or GEMDAS. So we'll follow the rule that we have posted a while ago. In here, we will have the groupings first. That's 4 times 1. But if for that, we'll copy first our given. That's 27 minus 9 divided by 3 times the quantity of 4 times 1. Okay, that's 4 times 1 is equal to 4. Next, we will divide because it says there that we have to do multiplication or division whichever comes first for in this case we have 9 divided by 3 first that will be 27 minus 3 times 4 this time we will multiply 27 minus 12 is equal to so that's 15 the answer for this question is 15 and that will be letter a now let's have the second question the quantity of 8 plus 12 times 6 minus 4. What do you think are we going to do first? Of course, we will do the groupings. That's 8 plus 12. Before that, we'll copy first the given. 8 plus 12 is equal to 20 times 6 minus 4. Next, we will multiply. 20 times 6 is 120 minus 4. Next, 120 minus 4 is equal to 160. Our answer for this question is letter B. Next question. The quantity of 3 plus 2 times 5 plus 4 minus 19. Is it A, 5, B, 10, C, 26, D, 30? Of course, we will do the groupings first. Before that, we have to copy our given. Okay. 3 plus 2 is equal to 5 times 5 plus 4 minus 19. Next, 5 times 5 is equal to 25. Next, 25 plus 4 is equal to 29 minus 19. 29 minus 19 is 10. Our final answer for this question is letter B. Next question. 5 squared plus 3 times 2 minus 1 to the 5th power. Is it A, 11, B, 21, C, 30, and D, 55? Since we don't have any groupings here, we automatically proceed to exponent. We'll copy our given 5 squared plus 3 times 2 minus 1 to the 5th power. 5 squared is 5 times 5 that will give us 25. Then copy plus 3 minus 2 and the answer for 1 to the 5th is 1 because that's 1 times 1 times 1 times 1 times 1. That will give you 1. Next, we'll proceed to multiplication. 3 times 2 is equal to 6. Next, 25 plus 6 is 31 minus 1. That gives us 30. Our final answer for this question is letter C. 
we have the next one here that's 12 to the zeroth power plus the quantity of 100 to the first power minus 1 to the tenth power is it a 90 b 99 c 100 and d 111 we will do the groupings first that's 100 to the first power minus 1 to the tenth power we will copy our given first 100 to the first power is still 100 minus 1 to the tenth power is still 1 okay let's solve first 100 minus 1 that will give you 99 next any number raised to the zeroth power is equivalent to 1 that's why 120 to the zeroth power is 1 plus 99 is equal to 100 our final answer for this question is letter C. Next question, we have here the quantity of 54 divided by 9 plus the quantity of 3 to the 4th power minus 1. Is it A, 17, B, 28, C, 55, or D, 86? For this case, we have two groupings, so we have to do that one first. Let's copy our given. 54 divided by 9 is equal to 6 plus 3 to the 4th power will give us, that's 9 times 9 is equal to 81 minus 1. Next, grouping, that's 81 minus 1 is equal to 80. 6 plus 80 is equal to 86. The final answer that we have here is letter D. Next question. 2 times 15 divided by 6 plus 12 times 4. Is it A, 48, B, 53, C, 68, or D, 72? Since we don't have any groupings and exponent, we proceed right away to multiplication because it is the first one that we can see here from left to right. So, 2 times 15 is equal to 30. Next one is we have to divide 30 divided by 6 is equal to 5 plus 12 times 4. Next is we have to multiply. 12 times 4 is equal to 48. And that's 5 plus 48 is equal to 53. Our final answer for this question is letter B. Now, it is your turn to solve. Please write your answer in the comment section. The question is, find the value of 10 to the 4th power times the quantity of 12 minus 4 divided by 2. I'll be waiting for your answer. Thank you! Don't forget to hit the like button if you think this is helpful. Till next time!